I want people to understand that, you know, the, the, the reason that we're all here is because of Dimebag. I mean, he brought us all together. But there were people that sacrificed everything, including their own f***ing lives, to try and protect him, to try and protect us. Jeff Thompson, mayhem, as everyone knows. He was our personal security, but more importantly, he was a good friend to all of us. And he even stated, I'll take a bullet for you. The way he said it, it rolled, it rolled off his back like, I'll take a bullet for you. I resigned about eight months ago to pursue my career in uh, construction management. I went back to school and got my degrees and I just wish I had been there to, 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 to help. I don't know if I could have helped. I, I, so I, could, I could be in a casket right now because the guy I hired to replace me is dead now too. And he was a close friend of mine. He kept his word and uh, he gave our band everything we ever wanted, including in life to save ours. It's amazing. He, he gave the ultimate sacrifice to take care of the people that he loved. He's part of the family. So many other heroic things happened that night. Our tour manager, Chris Paleska, tried to stop the guy that created this nightmare, took a bullet in the chest. Pretty f brave thing to do. I put him on the f***ing stretcher myself. That was the only thing that I could do, you know. John Graham, a.k.a. Bushman, a.k.a. Pete High, saved Vinnie Paul's life. Pushed him down to the floor. Jumped on top of him like a goddamn CIA f***ing Secret Service agent. That's why Vinnie Paul is alive today. Thank you. John Brooks, a.k.a. The cat, everybody knows. Best dude. F saved so many lives. Took three f bullets and lived to f tell about it. Bad f fucker. An innocent f person, a fan from the audience, tried to come up and help. Took a bullet. Died. A security guard that worked for the venue in Columbus, took a bullet and died. These people should not be forgotten. It's not just about dying. But dying brought us all together and he will always be remembered.